This is the Wampler Terraform and it packs a bunch of modulation effects, 11 to be exact, and it's a compact little pedal with a lot of sounds. So we have auto wah, envelope filter, we have flanger, phaser, we have the univibe, we have rotary, we have auto swell, harmonic tremolo, chorus, and dimension. So let's go through all those sounds and hear what they sound like and we have some controls to go along with uh, these settings here. Uh, we have rate, depth, blend, variable, and volume. And some of these uh, will control slightly different things based on what uh, effect we're on. And when I go to the effect, I'll explain what the knobs are doing. So we have bypass here. We can tap in the speed of the effects. And we have eight presets that we can save and recall here. So stereo in stereo out or you can do mono in mono out we have a switch on the back also that we can do pre or post uh, if we're running mono we can just use the other jacks for a post or pre kind of effects so we can place the terraform before or after drive pedals we have midi in and out using very small 3.5 jacks and we can do midi controls on this as well and we also have an expression port which we can control any parameter with an expression pedal. So I'm playing on the Strat, going into the Terraform and into a Vox AC30. We're doing stereo, a Vox and a Marshall on the other side. So, so our first setting is the Auto Wah. That's what I was playing in the intro. So the controls are rate controls the speed of the Auto Wah. We have the depth. Um, this controls the filter. And then uh, the variable is controlling the Q of the the wah sound, and then we can blend from dry to full auto wah or in between. And volume is just kind of a, a boost in signal, so we have unity gain at 12 o'clock, and we can cut or boost. So let's check out auto wah. <laughs> So let's go to the uh, envelope filter setting here. Um, rate is going to be controlling the attack speed. And then the um, depth is going to control the envelope sensitivity. Um, variable is going to be controlling our Q. So let's check that out. Thank you. 
So the next setting is the flanger. So the rate is uh, controlling the effect and the depth is also controlling the effect. And then we have the variable which is controlling the feedback level. Next setting is the phaser. So in the phaser, the controls are, we have the rate and depth for filter range, and we have the variable knob here is doing the stereo width, and clean blend and volume are standard. Bye. 
Next setting is the Univibe. So the controls are we're going to have rate and the depth is going to be the filter range and variable knob is going to be the wave shape. So let's check it out. The next setting is the rotary. The rate controls the maximum speed of the horn, and then we have the depth is the maximum woofer speed. And blend, we go uh, between the horn and the woofer, so we get a kind of a high and low sound. So to the left is a lower woofer sound, to the right is the higher um, horn sound, and we can fine tune the sound. And then the variable controls the ramp speed. So when we hit our tap tempo, we're going to go between the slow and the fast speed, which we can control with the rate and the depth. Thank you. 
The next setting is the auto swell and the variable here is controlling the pick attack and everything else is standard. Our next setting is the tremolo. So we have the rate and the depth as standard. We have variable controlling the waveform width and then the volume and blend are controlling the stereo width. All right, next setting is the harmonic tremolo and it's similar to the tremolo. We have the rate and the depth and we have the variable controlling the width and the volume is controlling and the blend, the blend and volume is controlling the crossover point. Let's check it out. Thank you. 
So the next setting is chorus and we have the rate, the depth and our variable is controlling the width of the chorus. And the last setting is the dimension. And in this, we control the rate, depth, and the variable is controlling the amount of bass. And let's check it out.